Welcome back to my channel. I missed y'all. Your glitter girl is back. Today I am making a coffee table out of Dollar Tree picture frames. I will first be starting off with eight four by six picture frames from the Dollar Tree. And I will be removing the glass and the paper from the frames. After that part is done, I will take my frames and spray paint them silver. And I also separated the glass from the paper. And I used Gorilla Glue Sticks to attach the glass to the frames. After I glued the glass on the frame, I took the frame outside and spray painted the glass silver and I spray painted the back of the glass and not the front. And after that, I attached the back of the frame just to make it more sturdy. Next, I grabbed my Mod Podge and I am going to go around the perimeter and just fill the frame up with it. And after that, I'm gonna take my crush mirror and I'm gonna pour it all around and make sure that I cover the whole frame with it. And I didn't show it, but I did add glitter just to give it an extra sparkle. And if you're a glitter babe, I say this almost every video I use crushed rocks with, there's an expensive way to use it, and that's the Michaels way where you get the crushed glass from there. But there's also a Dollar Tree way where I spray paint the rock silver and I add glitter and that works as well. After that is done, I'm just going to take my mirror towels and go around the perimeter of the frame. Now I'm going to finish the other seven frames and let them dry and then move on to the table. And after that is done, I'm gonna take my hot glue gun and I'm gonna go over the side with my hot glue. And I told you guys that I'm using Gorilla Glue, uh, Gorilla Hot Glue. And this is gonna work perfectly because it sticks and it's really hard to pull them apart. Now the plan is to create an octagon so I'm going to do one side and then do the other side and then connect them. So 
so now that this side is done I'm going to do the other side the same way with three frames and then I'm going to add the other two frames in the middle of each I previously cut this piece so I'm going to use my Gorilla Glue to glue it on and then I'm going to show you how I trace this piece. I also went along the sides with my Gorilla Glue and I'm just doing this to make the frames more secure. Now I will be creating the top of the table. I used this hard board from Home Depot and I just used a pair of pliers to cut it. It's a very thin board. Um, but it's also very sturdy. And now I'm just covering the top with this mere reflective paper. After that is done, I'm just turning the back around and taking a pair of scissors and cutting off all the excess paper. And now for the fun part, I am taking my mirrored squares and I'm just going around the perimeter and gluing them down. And I'm basically just following the shape of the table. Then I'm going to take more square mirrors and overlap the uh, other squares and I'm doing that because I'm trying to create the shape of the top. And this is how the top of the table looks when it's done. And here is the final product. And you could always add legs, I just chose not to. And if you would rather use regular glue sticks, you can always just get foam board and put them inside to make the table more sturdy. Thank you all so much for watching my channel, for liking my videos, for subscribing. You all make me so happy. Please stay safe out there and take care and see you on the next video.